Hey everyone, I hope you guys are all doing well. So, uh, if you guys missed the short from last night, uh, I was in my kitchen, which uh, is something new for you guys, I'm sure. I think I've done one one video uh, in the past, a while back. So, uh, but yeah, I'm in my kitchen and uh, I am actually trying out something I've never tried before. I'm extremely excited about it. Uh, I wanna say thank you so very much to Brits uh, Fermented Foods. They actually sent the items that you see here. I got Brits Black Market Kimchi. It's actually made with black garlic. I'm very excited to uh, try this. And uh, I'll read you some of the information off the bags. It's very, very cool. Uh, Brits Whole Pickles. They're spicy pickles. There's like, I'm not sure how many in here, like I think 10 or so. Very excited about trying those. And these are just, I believe these are just snack packs. So I think these are just like a dill type pickle um, or a garlic type pickle. I don't know, because I haven't tried any of them yet. So, uh, and then also we have Brits horseradish brine shots. So all of these things that you see here are all made with uh, water, no vinegar, um, no heat. So it's an extremely unique pickle and kimchi uh, that doesn't use vinegar. Uh, it actually uses uh, microbes and enzymes to turn and lactic acid um, to turn basically cucumbers into pickles without the actual, you know, pickling, I guess per se. So, you know, or the, the traditional pickling in a sense. So I am going to try all these on camera and actually just to tell you a little bit about the company. And it's kind of cool. I, again, I love this. Uh, I love this cutout they made for me so i was gonna hang it up here uh let me show you real quick so isn't that awesome i love companies that are just so personable there's been so many companies that have been amazing and uh brits is one of them so i will read you what they wrote it says hey josh we are excited for you to try our products here at brits fermented foods we are proud to take part in an ancient tradition of oak, bar uh, oak barrel fermentation. And not only does this create a flavor that will knock your massive socks off, <laughs> because they know I'm a giant. Uh, good, good pun on words there. Uh, it says, but it also fills each pouch with bacteria for a healthy, happy gut. I'm extremely excited about trying that because uh, as some of you know, maybe many of you know, um, I have, actually lost around 145 pounds in the last year and a half just eating better uh drinking more water eating healthier um trying to go on you know walks and just do more exercise so this is kind of a fun part of my journey because i get to try these foods and uh you know they're they're great for you too so that's awesome if they taste great and they're good for you that's a bonus <laughs> so um but it says, yeah, it says, thank you for working with us. We look forward to being your new favorite pickle, your new friends, the Brits Fermented Foods team. So very cool. <laughs> that is awesome. I love the uh, personable letter there. So, and it basically says that uh, their journey begins with actual oak barrels. Uh, from the video that I watched, it says that they were repurposed wine barrels so they actually go through and they clean them out um they they sand them down i mean it goes through a big process to make them um make them whole again and make them you know pretty much brand new so they reuse those and as far as i know they are the only con company in the united states that actually uses oak barrels for their pickles and their kimchi which is very cool so um but yeah if you guys want to look them up online I am going to leave uh, the link down in the description. And I'll also, if you guys use code uh, Big Papa Foot, you get 20% off on their website. So awesome. <laughs> There's so many good things. Without further ado, I'm going to start trying these because I know you guys want to see that. Um, give me just a moment. So let's try. I want to get to the I want to get to the pickles. And you guys got to check here check this bag out i'm gonna i'm gonna actually just look make sure i'm all framed up good still yep i know it's gonna run a little bit long but it's all good it's all good so um so this says the original superfood a very long time ago in an ancient tigris river valley someone dropped a cucumber in a pot of salt water then forgot about it a week or so later they discovered not only was it still edible 
but it was also both delicious and invigorating. Lo and behold, the first pickle was born. <laughs> Very cool. It says, over the centuries, many methods of preservation have been tried, from freezing to vinegar baths, but only lactic acid fermentation uh, produces a pickle preserve that is arguably more beneficial to your gut and your immune system than the original vegetable that you're eating, uh, even fresh. So it says a legendary flavor combo. The cucumber pickle has never or has had never such a quintessential accomplice as the spicy chili pepper. Our classic spicy pickles, a favorite of those who prefer a punch with a, their hors d'oeuvres uh, with a bit of heat, you know who you are. That's me. I love spicy stuff. Uh, just the right amount of spice. It's truly a match made in heaven. Uh, spicy is to pickle as Esther was to Rogers, as Maude was to Harold, as Wesley to Buttercup. That's cool. You get the point, it says. <laughs> so, seven secrets of stellar pickles. Oak barrels. That's the number one thing. It says they're a living ingredient in Brit's pickles. Uh, tannic acid in the oak actually keeps the pickles crispy. And then it has superior sea salt crystals that are used in Brit's pickles. No additives, it says only the best, <laughs> so that's awesome. Uh, garlic, I love garlic so much. I'm actually so excited to try the kimchi. My mouth is watering, and I got a little uh, a little surprise for uh, Brits for Minute Foods that they don't know about yet. So this is all me, guys. This is this is going to be like a 10 minute, maybe 12 minute video, but you know, it's me. It's I'm a real person. I'm in my house. I'm having a good day. So I hope you guys are having a good day also. <laughs> um, but let's see, so it says garlic. Uh, mis uh, mystical powers have a magical effect on the flavor. Can you taste the zippy wow wow yum? <laughs> uh, turmeric root, which is extremely good for you. It says the many health ben uh, benefits it adds to our amazing brines. Don't forget to drink the brine. So the brine, they actually sell separate and you're at the end of this or in the middle, whenever you can actually drink it. And the brine is packed full of nutrients and probiotics and enzymes, just good stuff. Good stuff that we need in our bodies. Um, let's see, so, and then it says gratitude for family, the earth, the kooks, um, the farmers that grew them and the ancestors who passed down the tra uh, tradition. And it says collaboration, great pickles are the product of an alliance with nature. Combine the ingredients and let nature do its work. So very cool. There's all kinds of information on here. I really do like the, the, the front of this. I mean, it looks, you know, like they took time. I really like, I love the cucumber superheroes. Um, it says they're the fermented defenders. So very awesome. I hope I'm in frame. I hope I am. I'm so tall guys. You guys can see these are like giant. I think what do I have 10 foot ceilings in here. I'm glad I do. Cause I'd probably hit my head. So, um, anyways, but yeah, it says chipotle peppers, garlic, onion, spices, so without further ado, I know, I know that took a long time to read, but it's good, uh, it's good information. So I have never had a pickle. Wow. Oh, oh my God. Okay. So if, if these taste as good as they smell, wow. Okay. I just unzipped the pouch. I didn't even, I didn't even open the pouch. I just wow so reaching in here i don't know if i'm gonna get this in the camera or not actually hold on hold on hold on i'm not gonna i'm not gonna eat it just yet i want to show you guys this hopefully without spilling there is some good stuff going on there there is onion and peppercorn so i grabbed this whole pickle right here this smells absolutely amazing so here we go cheers If I don't hide these, if I don't hide these, my wife is going to eat all of them. My kids are going to eat all of them. My mom is going to eat all of them. Wow. So I never test anything on my stream or my, my YouTubes, whatever. I'd never test anything that I wouldn't eat myself or drink myself or use myself. 
and I try to be, you know, as good as a person who describes things well, <laughs> although I can't get my words out right now, but this has so much flavor. I absolutely love spicy stuff. This isn't like, this is on the scale of maybe Tabasco. Um, I'm not quite sure because I love spicy stuff, so it's kind of hard to gauge, but maybe not quite Tabasco. Um, like flaming Hot Cheetos, something like that. So absolutely amazing. Like, mm. and it's crazy. It's like, it's seriously like an explosion in your mouth. It's like, it's super tangy and you get like this. I don't even know how to explain it. You get like this, like tangy, like just burst of flavor. Those are really, really, really good. <laughs> um, wow, that's the first product and I'm, yeah. So, it's so crazy. Each time you bite into it, you get, um, I, I don't know how else to explain it. Like it seriously, it seriously feels like this like little tangy explosion. It's not, it's salty, but it's almost like that umami effect oh that is so delicious all right so i'm gonna set this down on a little plate here wow that is so good okay next we're gonna try the black garlic black market kimchi i grew up in seattle for many many years and oh wow okay just un just unsealing this i can smell oh my goodness i know sorry i started saying i started telling you guys i grew up in seattle and then this amazing scent hit me but yeah i grew up in seattle and i would go to many different restaurants um that smells like <laughs> i was gonna say so i've gone to so many so many different restaurants, Asian restaurants, and so many of these restaurants I've eaten kimchi at. So I've had very authentic kimchi and this tastes just, or this smells absolutely amazing. It looks really amazing. So my dog actually ran upstairs real quick. She's like, hey, what's going on? And <laughs> she, uh, you can't have any? Nope, you can't. So yeah, there's all kinds of stuff Wow, that is really, really cool. Trying to get a good shot. So just looking at it, yeah, you can see there's all kinds of delicious stuff and you can really see that um, this doesn't look like normal kimchi. It it, it has a, more of an orange tint to it. Wow, it smells so good. <laughs> all right, let me grab a fork here. And so yeah, this will be the first time I've had kimchi that's not pickled in vinegar. I didn't know there was such a thing. And I grew up, like I said, in Seattle. So so yeah, here we go. I'm excited. This smells, my mouth is watering so much. This smells so delicious. That is so good. And again, you get that, that salty, Umami, just amazing taste. And so much garlic. If you like garlic, the black garlic in that, <laughs> it's like an explosion of flavor. Wow. Sorry, I'm not trying to eat with my mouth, but, or, or talk while uh, I have food in my mouth. That is amazing. Um, you can taste, I don't even know how to explain it. You guys just need to go, go try some. If you like kimchi, if you like kimchi and you didn't like this, I would be extremely surprised. This is, yeah, oh, my wife and my kids are going to eat all this. I'm so worried. <laughs> um, so on here, I don't want to read all of it because there's a lot to read on here, but it basically says an age old tradition. Again, they use oak barrels, but then it says a dark new twist. So they use 
that black garlic. My nose is running a little bit. It's not that spicy, it just allergies on top of a little bit of spicy stuff. So, <laughs> um, absolutely amazing. <laughs> I'm just, wow. So I'm hoping that people down in the comments, if you've had this company's kimchi or pickles, please let me know. That is so good. Um, I know for a fact that my wife and kids are gonna just absolutely tear that up. <laughs> so this one is an extremely unique product. Sorry. There we go. All right. So this is horseradish dill brine shots. And it's basically all that delicious stuff, all the probiotics, enzymes, all that great stuff packed in just a brine that you actually pour into a shot glass and drink a shot glass of this every day. So I shook it up earlier, but I'm going to shake it up again. I cannot believe the smell, guys. This is this is sealed. I was making sure I didn't spill. This is sealed and I can smell. If you like horseradish, this is delicious. So I already know with the other items that I've already tried, this is gonna be yummy. My nose is still actually running just a slightly bit. Okay, here, one moment. So I am just pouring the brine into the shot glass that they provided me. The brine, or the brine is a, Kind of a yellowish color, I guess. Um, I am colorblind, but I can tell it's a yellowish color. So this is the horseradish brine. Excuse me. They actually sent me the shot glass. Had me handmade in oak barrels. So very cool. I'm excited to try this. I love horseradish. My nose is dripping a little bit already. So, all right, here we go. Cheers. I'm gonna see what this tastes like. It is amazing, amazing smelling. Okay. So to be honest with you guys, <laughs> I've never tried anything like that in my life. I was a little worried just because I love horseradish, but I wasn't sure if it was gonna be like, you know, that crazy pungent horseradish. It's, it's, it's strong, but it's not overly strong. Um, if that makes sense, but wow, that is amazing. I, uh, I definitely can't wait and I'll definitely, uh, do a future video much shorter, of course, but basically doing an update on how I feel after, after trying this, you know, for three or four or five days or a week. And, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm excited. I get, it, it sounds weird and it could be the spices and fun stuff in it, but I actually feel good. Like I feel like I drank a bunch of coffee. <laughs> uh, I'm eating the rest of that pickle. So uh, on a separate video, I will be making with the black market kimchi, a grilled cheese and kimchi sandwich. So look for that in a future video coming up here in about a week or so. Uh, thank you so much to everyone who tuned in tonight. Thank you so much to Brits pickles. I am going to try these really quick after I swallow this. I'm truly grateful for uh, you guys giving me a chance. I know this ran a little bit long, but <laughs> it, uh, wow. Wow. So if you go on their website right now, again, if you use Big Papa Foot, if you use that code, it'll get you 20% off. They have something that looks so delicious. It's Mexican kimchi. Um, they didn't send this, uh, send it with this. I know it's a limited run that they're doing. So if you guys like Mexican flavors, it looks delicious. So I am going to try this. So these are just, I believe, just their normal mm, IPO snack pickles right there. So you can see there's nice, nice slices in there. I put two in because I know they're going to be good. So yeah, if you've never had a pickle that's not in vinegar, I've never had a pickle that wasn't made with vinegar. Um, wow. I am blown away. 
<laughs> this is so, so good. So yeah, I definitely, like I said, I am going to uh, make a video sometime in the near future. In the next handful of days, I'm gonna be making that grilled cheese sandwich. That sounds delicious. It's a recipe that a friend of mine who tried some of this actually gave to me. So um, definitely tune in for that, guys. And again, um, I will leave the link down below. You can find all this stuff in in uh, their shop. And again, thank you guys for tuning in. I'm, I'm so grateful for all the love and support. I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you.